today we're going to be reading another article, but today it's not printed out. My mom wrote it this time. She just copied it. She just copied the article. Yeah. Okay, so let's get right into it. Vincent Van Gogh. Vincent Van Gogh was a very famous artist who lived a long time ago, born in the Netherlands. In 1853. He came from a family with a lot of brothers and sisters. And his dad was a minister. A minister. A minister. Vincent really liked drawing, which he learned from his mom, who also loved art. Yeah, so I actually also love art. Mm -hmm. I'm also good at it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Really? Yes. What do you like to draw? I like, sometimes I like to draw trees. Yeah. You like to draw trees, but you like to, you like. So, sometimes I need peace, and sometimes I feel like drawing nature. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sometimes I, I'm in the mood for nature. Awesome. Yeah. When Vincent grew up, he faced many problems, especially with his feelings and how he saw the world. Sometimes he felt very sad, and other times he felt very, he felt happy. These feelings made his life a bit hard. He tried different jobs, be, being an art dealer or a teacher, but he always felt drawn to work. Yeah, that's sad. Well, he really loved art because of his mother. That's right. Yeah. Vincent taught himself how to paint because he did not go to an art school. He looked at other artists' work and tried to make his art just like theirs. But as time passed, he started to find his own style. He used bright colors and bold brush strokes to show how he felt inside. Yes. So his artwork? So his artwork is very good. Mm -hmm. Like, I love it. Those yeah. are expressions of his like, personality, right? Yeah, and how he saw the world. That's right. Yes. Yeah. In 1886, Vincent moved to a big city called Paris, where he met other artists, artists and learned new things. He became friends with people like Paul Gauguin and started to paint even more. But even with his success, Vincent still had problems. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very sad. Very really sad. Yes, he still had problems. His feelings sometimes got too intense and he had to go to the hospital for help. That's uh, That's yeah, right? If he was good, if he felt better, he could he could paint his entire life. <laughs> yeah. He would be a lucky person if, if he had a chance. One of the most famous parts of Vincent's, Vincent's life was when he lived in a small town called Auro in France. There he painted some of his most famous pictures, like the starry night and sunflowers. But even in Auro, Vincent had a hard time. He got into fights with his friends and even hurt himself badly. Mm, Sadly, Vincent's life ended when he was only 37 years old. He Died. died by he su su suicide, which means he hurt himself on purpose. Mm. Yeah, I feel bad for him. True. Yeah, true. Yeah. Very true. I wish he had a longer life. How did he? How did he hurt himself? By by he su suicide. He, suicide. suicide. But he shot himself like. <laughs> Like imagine this is a gun and I'm him. <laughs> yeah, suicide. Don't laugh, that's sad. Yeah, I know. Suicide is bad. Yeah. 
Even though Vincent struggled a lot during his life, people now love his paintings. His art shows us his feelings and how he saw the world. Today, Vincent van Gogh is remembered as one of the greatest artists ever. And his paintings are famous all around the world. Here are three of Vincent Van Gogh's famous paintings. Number one, Starry Night, 1889. Starry Night is one of Vincent Van Gogh's most famous paintings. It depicts a, a, a screen sky filled with swirling clouds and bright stars above a peaceful village. Mm. Yes. I would have lived in that village, but sadly that village isn't isn't real. Isn't real. <laughs> yes, that was in the past. That was just in know, the past. Yeah, in the past. We have to move like on. A, like a subject of yeah, we his have, imagination. Yeah, it's imagination. Mm -hmm. The sky is dominated by deep blues and swirling patterns, while the village below is illuminated, illuminated by warm yellow light. Yeah, I like that. Number two, Sunflowers, 1888. Sunflowers is a series of still life paintings by Vincent van Gogh, Gogh depicting vibrant yellow sunflowers, arranged in a vase, in, in a vase. The paintings showcase the artist's bold use of color and dynamic brushwork, capturing the beauty and energy of the flowers. Ooh, sunflowers. Have yeah. you seen those paintings? Yeah, just once. Oh, I see. Once. Okay. So, so I just remember a little part. Okay. Yeah. Number three, the bedroom. 1888. Same as sunflowers. The bedroom is a painting that the plants Van Gogh's own bedroom in the yellow house in Auro, in France. The room is sparsely, sparsely, sparsely furnished, furnished with simple rustic, rustic. rustic furniture, furniture and bright solid colored walls. The, the perspective. The perspective yes. is slightly distorted, giving the room a sense of depth and int intimacy. intimacy. The bedroom is a deeply personal desire of stability and belonging by painting his own bedroom. He's he sought to create a sense of home and comfort amidst the challenges he faced in his life. Mm, that's why he drew that bedroom, right? Yeah. Sadly, Vincent Van Gogh died. So yeah. rest in peace, <laughs> Vincent Van Gogh. So, now, what, what country was Vincent Van Gogh born in? Netherlands. Mm, how did he learn to paint? He thought himself and, and other art artists taught him. Oh, okay. And what city did he move in to in Paris. 1886? Paris. Paris, right. Paris. What did he do there? He, he met other artists and started to paint more. Okay. More than drawing. Yes. And then where did he live when he painted the famous works like The Starry Night and Sunflowers? Arles. Arles, okay. He lived in a small town called... Arl in Paris, right? Yes. How did he die? He died by suicide. Yeah, suicide. Yes, suicide. That's right. Suicide bad. And what jobs did he have? So he tried being an art dealer or a teacher, but he sadly failed. Why? Because he always felt drawn to art. He yeah. always wanted to draw mm. and paint. Mm, I see. He tried many jobs. Yes. So what are his famous paintings? Can you name them? Um, Sunflower, Starry Night, and Bedroom.
Yeah, what's the other one? The painting on your sketchbook. Oh. What's that? Almond Blossom? Almond. Almond Blossom. Yeah, that's right. I like it. I like it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, guys. So, bye-bye. <laughs>